Please like, subscribe, and share this content. It helps our page grow. I know a lot of the stuff I've been covering is pretty like in your face. It's pretty, it's pretty, uh, I don't want to say nerve wracking, but it affects us in our day to day. So I do have some very promising and very interesting news that I found on Ag Daily uh, this morning. Well, was, I think it was a couple of days, a couple of days ago. Um, but I, I revisit this morning. But I did see that DoorDash and Tractor Supply are partnering together to get agricultural goods to customers. So typically, historically, DoorDash has been a um, a food a food app where you can just go on and it's basically Uber with your fa- your favorite food option. But this partnership really stuck out to me because Tractor Supply. It would be typically like a, like a non-traditional partner in the aspect of what DoorDash started out being. So Tractor Supply is a chain of agricultural stores. It's, from my perspective, I think it would be the biggest. That's the only one I've seen in so many locations. They have over 2,100 stores, and DoorDash is partnering with 2,000 of those stores to bring your favorite and your most um, needed agricultural goods to your front door, which I think is a complete game changer in the field. For a couple of reasons. Number one, anyone who's just getting started in the field, say you have chickens and you don't know where to get chicken feed. Now, this DoorDash partnership makes chicken feed accessible to you. And that may sound taboo to people who are in agriculture and know that you need that. But for somebody who may not have that background, that's a complete game changer. I was definitely one of those people who did not have act, who did not have access to everything we needed when we first got into farming, and we figured it out as we got more experience. So now that learning curve could be um, could be you have more comfort in learning about about uh, agricultural production. They don't they not only um, sell chicken feed, but they sell tractor parts, they sell um, batteries, uh, car batteries, uh, garden supplies, shovels, rakes, hand tools. Um, I've seen apparel in the store, uh, farming apparel, of course. Um, I've seen mug boots. Um, I've, what else have I seen? They sell live chickens. So like, this is literally like your one-stop shop for starting your garden, your chicken pen, um, finding medications for your goats. I've bought that. They have a veterinarian center. So I think it's a really, really, really interesting um, partnership that I think has a lot of potential uh, I also think it's interesting because it serves people like me as well who are, uh, I don't want to say I'm like a highly experienced farmer, I've been doing it for six years, but this serves my demographic of farmers as well who may not have time, our business is growing, we may not have time to stop by a local tractor supply on on um, Tuesday, but we can hit our, go on the DoorDash app and have it delivered to our farm while we're gone. Even if we went to the store, it still fares better that we that we have these items um, delivered to us because there also there's a DoorDash pass that you can access that also that also waives the delivery fee so that's an added benefit for the farmer so those are two really uh, important demographics people just getting in and then also new farmers but then experienced farmers if they need something they may be older in age which we do know the average age of a farmer is 65 years old they now don't have to take that extra time and energy they can stay at the farm. Just um, or uh, it, it's less taxing on them. So I think this is a very exciting partnership. I am interested to see how people who don't live near tractor supplies are affected. I don't know if it can be sourced. The items can be sourced from like a third party vendor. DoorDash can still make that connection. But I do think with 2000 stores being able to offer this new feature, I think it overall is a very important um, step and where agriculture can go. And it's connecting the person who has maybe never had access to agriculture in any capacity. It's now bringing it to your front door, which I think also opens up the door to youth being involved, to non-traditional populations now having the opportunity to participate in the farming system, whether it be growing food, whether it be now having access to the apparel to now, because that can be a barrier for some people. I don't have the the boots. I don't have the clothes to actually go out and work. Like now, this this these barriers are now being um, addressed, and a new uh, demographic and a new um, population 
coming into farming, which is very, very exciting to me as a person who had those barriers, who didn't know uh, how to get chicken feed, who didn't have access to um, tractor parts. Now I know I can get my pin, my tractor pins and I can get my, my hitches when they malfunction on my track, my three-point hitch when, it mal- my, when one of the arms m- malfunction. I can now go to tractor supply and get these materials. So I think this cuts out a lot of the, the um, mystery that, surrounded, that surrounds farming. And I think also, which is an added benefit to this partnership is it now gives everyone an access to participate in the food economy because you have access to resources. So a lot of our a lot of our content caters to people already in agriculture. But now we can start like now that we know that this partnership is going on, we can start pointing people in direction and say, hey, under our video, this is where you get your fencing. This is where you get your feed. This is where you get your medication. This is how you identify these problems and this is how you solve them. So a lot of that learning curve I think now we can address and um and uh, allow more people to participate in the food system in some capacity. So I think this is very, 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 very exciting. Um, you all probably haven't seen me smile yet uh, when, in making these videos. I typically have a more serious um, uh, persona, but this makes me happy. I'm excited that we all now get to have a ham as this partnership rolls out, and it's no telling what this will, what this will, what this will um, evolve into. So I'm very happy to share that news with y'all, with you all. And if you like this content, please um, like the video, subscribe to the channel, share the channel, comment below, and this helps. This helps us with uh, spreading this uh, this good information that we're trying to get to um, get to our our community. So I hope you all have a great day, and I will see you all later.